bugs. <laughs> Critters. <laughs> Toads? Am I supposed to be responding? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, <laughs> How do they make you feel? Oh, horrible. Really? Well, I felt sorry for the cane toad the other day. What happened to the cane toad? <laughs> Talise found a cane toad in the pool. Mm -hmm. That's correct, I did. Yes. Gary comes out, picks it up by one leg, <laughs> launches it <laughs> off the balcony, veranda, I don't know what you call it. It's quite a big drop yeah. though, I think that's the key thing. Like, massive. Like a good house height. Would you say launch or uh, more like, you know, the shot put when you get a bit of an angle happening? So oh, shot flung. Maybe angle might be flung. Yeah. I thought it was dead. So I, <laughs> I felt a bit sorry for it and I watched it and it started crawling and I was like, oh, okay, mm. great. Yeah. yeah. Kind of hopped off the road. We have seen um, a, a victim of the road, cane toad wise, just down the street this morning though. So not sure if he did live through that experience. Pretty sure he did though. They're very resilient. What about the um, spiders in Australia? I know you've had an encounter recently with um, some spiders at the horses. Is that correct? Yeah, they're not nice. We did, that one was nearly drowned as well and it came back to life. Yeah, well, I was told it was dead and it wasn't dead. It started to move. But they're not cool, no matter how big or small. Just, yeah, don't go near them. Oh, I've got one. What about the other day when we were coming inside and you saw the prey mantis? Or the stick insect. Otherwise known as a prey mantis. Yes, Oh, same. is that a prey mantis? I'm pretty sure they're the same. I might have to check that fact, but I'm pretty sure they're oh, the same. I they were how big was it? Yeah, it was like... <laughs> <laughs> it was so big you had to stand back with your phone to take oh, a photo. I took a picture mm. and I was worried it was going to drop on me. Mm. But yeah, not cool and it didn't move. No, just, for like eight hours. Yeah. Just came back. It was fine. It just looked like a big stick. Mm. Yeah. Mm. What about um, the nightly carnage or homicides we face on the window, the kitchen window with the geckos? Uh, they're just, they're cute. I don't mind them. <laughs> but they eat a lot of flies and oh, they just jab at it. And I'm like, oh, what are you doing? <laughs> You need to calm down. <laughs> Speaking of flies, how are they going for you? Yeah, no. no don't like them. <laughs> <laughs> they just, they, they latch on to me and they're like, ah. Oh. And I do shower mm, mm. every day, but according to them, I smell still, so. Well, you know, yeah. the flies don't lie. They don't leave me alone. <laughs> And lastly, look, I don't think we can really wrap this up without mentioning the finer, finer bitey creatures that are a bit smaller in Australia. The beloved mozzies and midgies. How have you been with those? Have you had a good interaction so far? Oh, do you know what? They're loving me. I'm not loving them. It's just, you know, it's They're nightmare. kind of marking you, aren't yeah, they? It's like I, an Australian tattoo. I'm like a Dalmatian yeah. with mosquito bites. Except you're not black and white, you're tanned and red. Tanned and, tanned and red, yeah. yeah. It's not a good look, but... Nothing stops them. But they don't actually bite though. They're not all, they're, uh, let's just refer the midges. to, let's be clear about this. The mozzies bite, but the midges, what do they do? They wee on you. Yeah, they wee on you. Yeah, well, it's yeah. all class here in Australia. You'll love it. So um, Annie has got every manner of, uh, I think, repellent that she could possibly have whilst here in Australia. In fact, I'm surprised that they're not actually in the suburb of Cannonvale since she's moved into our house because she's got so many things to to put them off but look i'll keep you posted with her interactions i think the only creature you haven't really seen since you've been here is a snake yeah they're all right though you know they're just chilling whatever they'll be fine we hope, <laughs> we hope Anywho. Yeah. <laughs> fingers crossed we're gonna leave those alone um any any famous last words about the creatures in australia whilst you're here ants are horrible oh we didn't talk about the no. ants and, but, but you can lick their bums what's well, wrong well you ants? can lick the green ants bums and they taste of, like lime or something i haven't tried i wouldn't try you say that but i think that'd make for great footage yeah oh yeah oh, <laughs> oh yeah <laughs> i think we're in and look forward to that in the next episode of annie's australian adventures Thank <laughs> you.